Hello, hello! Welcome back to my channel. How are you doing? If you're like me, a Chinese currently in a foreign country, couldn't go home because of the pandemic, you're not alone. Today's art is about Chinese New Year, and I wish you Happy Chinese New Year in advance. And here I go, starting to sketch using one of the watercolor pencil again. That looks alright. Let's start working on the background. I know, I know, it's supposed to be all red, but um, I just want to create a really warm background instead of just red. So what the color that I use here is yellow, orange and a bit of red. Activate the background. Look at that color. So vibrant after you add water in it. It's time to bring out the subject of this art, which is the onion looking lanterns. Honestly, I didn't plan much for the color of each of the lanterns, I just follow my heart. And I discovered a really nice trick with watercolor pencil, which is the color white. It gives you so much control on the color that you can just blend it with the, the main color that you want to use. Painting something about Chinese New Year just remind me so much about my time in school. I still remember when it's close to Chinese New Year, the teacher in art class in school would just ask us to draw something about Chinese New Year. I remember hating that theme so much because it's just all the same each year and nothing new. Well, but now painting about Chinese New Year just remind me so much about home. Hope we can celebrate Chinese New Year back in Malaysia next year.
just when I move on to the second lantern, I just realized that I haven't light up all the lanterns yet. So I'm just going to do that. Put a bit of light yellow and blend it in. Now that my lanterns are lit, literally lit. have a bit of details to complete the whole painting that's the fun part you can just add in any patterns you want on your lanterns who cares if it's not the traditional looking lanterns as long as it makes you happy Don't know if you can see it here, I'm actually doing a bit of splashing of red on the painting just to complete the look. I can't remember when was the last time I had write Chinese words, so just bear with me. It's not any amazing hand calligraphy here, just a whiff of Chinese, I guess. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in next session.